Hi, welcome to Saturn Home. This is Vicki. Thank you so much for watching. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. And today I'm going to go over my um, recent haul. It's kind of a big one from Bath and Body Works. This is a, a cumulative haul. It's for like two visits or two um, purchases. And so first I'm going to go over the candle here. It's the Key Lime Pie. And this one here I bought because, you know, I thought it was going to smell like the soap, which is the Key Lime. Um, I bought this one too, the Key Lime Biscotti. And to be honest with you, I like the Key Lime Biscotti. Um, um, as far as the scent, I like this one better. But um, because it does have a pastry note on this in the soap. But the one in the candle of the Key Lime Pie, I don't really get. I like a pie note. I really like this one, the Key Lime Biscotti. Oh my gosh, I need to get more of these. So good. Um, the Key Lime Biscotti is so very good. I love this one. And um, but this, that's the reason I bought the Key Lime Pie. But I'll let you know that this one um, mainly smells to me like a limeade. It's kind of like a, yeah, like a limeade. And um, as far as the throw, right now it's kind of going on. It's, it's on the second day, and it's maybe on the second hour. So it's still not fully pulled completely. There's still some, you know, wax around the edges. And this one, the throw on this one is about, um, let's say, I'd say about a, um, like the first day was really strong. It was like about an eight. And today, well, it's only in the second hour, so it's not that strong. Maybe it hasn't, because it hasn't full, pulled yet. But it is um, about a seven. Yeah, about a seven right now. And uh, so I wish I could I could read you the notes on it, but I don't have it with me, unfortunately, because then I can't turn over the candle right now. But it's basically like key lime, and um, I think it's whipped cream, and gra graham cracker, I believe. Um, I'm not for certain, so, but I will insert the the to the you know the notes on the actual whenever I do the editing. But anyway, so I got this one. Like I said, I don't really like it. I, I had bought two, and I had returned the other one. And but it's a good scent. But I'm not too really crazy about lime scents. Um, but it's good. I mean, I don't know why I bought the key lime. To, you know, hello, I like you know it's lime. But I was really thinking it was gonna have like a little bit of a, like a pastry note, like a graham cracker, which I love the graham cracker, graham cracker note from Bath and Body Works. But I mean, this one's an okay um, scent. I mean, it's pretty popular and. Um, I like it, but it's not like something that I'm gonna, you know, go buy and you know go run to the store and buy you know, buy more of it. So it's okay. The throw, like I said, is gonna be about an eight at first in your first day, and then I don't know maybe because today the second day and it's still not fully completely pulled. It's almost there, like 99 percent. But as far as the scent throw on the second day, I have like a seven. It's burning clean. There's no soot or anything like that. To, you know, as far as right now. And but the scent you can just pick up like I said it's just a key lime it's like more like not even a key lime it's more like it's a lime it's a little bit sweet but just a tad it's not like it's not like a a true key lime pie scent obviously it's gonna be kind of hard to replicate but it's just a lime like a limeade okay and um, I just wish it had a little bit of, it has a little bit of a fizz in there and I just wish that it had a little bit more of a pastry note but it's still good you know if you like um, lime scents. And this is a really good one um, as far as for spring or summer, any part of your room, living room. I think it would kind of get, it'll probably get lost in the living room. Maybe like you'll probably lose a couple of points, maybe go like the six to a seven um, initial burn. And, um, but yeah, this is a good scent. It's um, one of the sweet shops and it's pretty good. But let's go for the other, I'm going to go first all through the candles that I bought and then I'm going to go to the soaps, okay? The first one, I've been looking, I'm trying to look for a really good, um, vanilla bean or like a vanilla buttercream and so I know the one from White Barn is really good so I got the vanilla bean um let's see the White Barn for, uh, vanilla bean and this one's really uh, this is just like a quintessential vanilla um you know kind of creamy uh, vanilla okay it's not very like you know um it's creamy it's a very it's a very creamy vanilla which I like that and the notes on that is I'm going to see if you can see this. Um, I'm trying to situate it to where you can see it. It's uh, Madagascar, Madagascar Vanilla Homemade Marshmallow Fresh Steam Milk. You may not get just like a, like a creamy vanilla. It's more like that. It's like, yeah, it smells good. I like it. It's like one of my favorites. Uh, one of my favorite vanillas, okay? So um, that's why I was happy. I was looking for it. And finally, I went to the store, I think it was Saturday, and they had it. So I bought two of these, and this is the Vanilla Bean. From White Barn okay this is a really good one I've had this before it has a very very strong throw it's very good I love that one and the next one I bought was um, something really completely out of my realm but I really like this one because when I smell of the store I don't know something something about it just kept calling me back and it's kind of I just love it and it is I'm sorry about that um, it is 
all stuff on white barn and this lemon mint leaf and this one just smells like to me like the orbit that um sweet mint i love that and it's a little bit of lemon too so it's kind of like just orbit with a little bit of lemon in there so the orbit um sweet mint with you know a little bit of lemon isn't the lemon is not a, not tart or anything like that it's just kind of like a smooth you know kind of like a I'm not going to say creamy lemon, but it's just like a lemon. Um, it's not sugared either. It's just like a very, you know, the lemon is there and the mint is nice. It's very sweet. Not sweet like two words. Disgustingly sweet, but it's really nice. So I'm definitely going to try this one. And I'm going to definitely review this one because I think this is a really good one for spring and summer. And this one is White Barn Lemon Mint Leaf. And let me give you the notes. I forgot to give you the notes. And also, I mean, uh, the notes are, well, hopefully you'll be able to see it. Um, sparkling lemon zest, spearmint leaves, verbena, verbena springs. It smells like that. It does have the, the verbena, uh, the spearmint and the verbena. We'll get the verbena and lemon zest for sure. Oh my gosh, I love this one. And I'm not really much of a mint kind of person, but that one smells amazing. And the other one is, um, it's going to be Flamingo Beach. And this one, oh my gosh, this one smells so good. I love this one. I heard it smells like pink sands from you know Yankee can Yankee Candle. I actually had the wax melt and it does kind of smell like that. Oh my gosh, this one smells so so good. And this one, um, the notes are going to be. Let's see here. I'm going to try to hold it so we can you know you can see it also. It is um, hopefully it's going to it's not going to it's going to focus. It says here it goes. Pink summer berries, juicy orange, and dewy white petals. It smells just like pink sands. Oh, it's super good. It's kind of like a floral with a little bit of fruit. Yeah, juicy. Yeah, there's a little bit of fruit in there. A floral. It's not too, like, you know, the floral is a true floral. It's not like, not, and there's no, like, um, what's it called? You know, amber or anything like that. It's not a perfumey floral. It's just like a true floral. Oh my gosh. I love this one. It smells so, so good. I love this one. And also, like I said, I had bought two key lime pies and I returned one. And then I got ended up getting two of these because I did not know that these were actually um, pistachio ice cream. <clears throat> so, excuse me. So I got the best mom ever. And when I realized it was pistachio ice cream, I just ran to go to the store to switch that out. And get. And I got two of these. And this one is, like I said, it's pistachio ice cream. And it smells amazing. It smells like almond pistachio, kind of, you know. So let's get to the notes. See what they, let me see what they say here. Um. It says roasted pistachio, frozen almond cream, and lush vanilla bean. You can definitely get the almond and you definitely get the pistachio. I love this one. This is one of my favorites of all time. It's the pistachio ice cream. I do have an older version of last year, but I really like this packaging, even though it does have the quotable. You know, it's still cute. I like it. And so I bought two of those. And um, also I got another one. I have it on, on display right now. And this one is a strawberry pound cake. And this one is like really kind of like, you know, popular right now. People are like really loving this one. And this one is a strawberry pound cake, okay? It's really, really pretty. Look at the beautiful packaging. I like the packaging, you know, because it's very pink and very floral, you know. And the notes on that one, I know it's going to be, it's, it, the, the notes sound delicious, you know. And the notes going to be on this. It's going to be, hopefully you'll be able to read it. Fresh strawberries, golden shortcake, and a dollop of whipped cream. And you do get the strawberries. And you do get a cream nut for sure. It smells like what, like a strawberry shortcake to me. Oh my gosh. This smells like strawberry shortcake. Oh my gosh, it's amazing. So this one, I only got one. I'm going to test it out to see if I like it as far as the scent on, you know, while it's burning. And then also the performance. And then if I like it, I'll probably get, a, you know, grab a couple of more. A couple more. <laughs> and that one. And so then I also got this candle stand. I got that for sale on sale. And then I also have another stand, but it's already put up. Okay, and then I got today. I went no. This is this was today's purchases, and then when they had the Bath and Body Works, this, the the soaps. I think they were like six for eighteen or something like that. I got of course I got the pink petal tea cake. That one smells really good. It smells just like exactly like the candle. I love pink petal tea cake, and then I got um, a watermelon lemonade. Of course, I know it's kind of like you know old fashioned. And I, I it's a classic for me. It, this is definitely. Uh, a staple or definitely a necessity for summertime and this is watermelon lemonade I love this one I got two of those and this is the old one this is from um, I guess this one's from last year or something um, this one is watermelon lemonade too I, I, I fortunately found this one so 
but this one is water lemonade, watermelon lemonade. And I was like, oh my god, that's cute packaging. So I got that one. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then I got blueberry crumble. You know, people are talking about this one as well. This one smells really good. It smells like a blueberry with like 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 um. How should I say it? It definitely smells like like it's definitely a dessert um dessert scent. But it's got like what oh, is it called like crumbles or something? Like maybe graham crackers crumbles on top. It's blueberries, and it's not like to me. It smells like a really true flu blueberry. This is blueberry. It doesn't smell like artificial to me. Oh my gosh, I love this one. Um, and this one is the blueberry crumble. And I think I'm gonna have to get some more of these. I think I want to get the whole sweet um, sweet shop line. And I do have the key lime. I think I'm missing one. I don't know. Um, but this one is the blueberry crumble. This one's excellent. I love this one. And then I like I already showed you the key lime biscotti. This one is so good. Oh my gosh, you have to smell this one. It's really good. It's got the you know the key lime, and then it also has the graham cracker note on this one. You can actually smell it to me. Oh my gosh. Yes, this is this is excellent. This is one of the one of the best ones I've s smelled or whatever sniffed. Um, this 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 summer or this you know during the season I love this one key lime biscotti, so I got that. And then also when today I went, went you know to Bath Body Works, I guess it's got a tester of gingham because I'm not really too familiar with the scent. I mean I know it's a new scent. It smells good. Let me see. I think I can smell it better in this in the spray, but this one I just like the packaging to be honest with you. It's got the little gingham and the little checker. You know I guess the same thing. You know gingham. It's really cute. I love that. And I just got this this um, tester, I mean this the purse one, the purse size of the gingham also. And this one, let me see what it smells like. I don't know. I think maybe they have the notes on there. I'm not even sure. But um, it smells like a perfume. It just smells like a perfume. Really nice. It smells like it has a little bit of freesia in there, which I love freesia. I do smell a little bit of freesia in there. I don't know. I have to read the notes on it. I think it might have it on the... On the no, it doesn't have it on the lotion, lotion either. Let me see. It doesn't have it. I don't think. Mm, oh, yeah, it does. It does, but you can't really see it. I'll put it in the... You know, when I do editing, I'll put the notes on there for you so you can... You know, cause, but I think it does have like a little bit of freesia in there. And then I got these two sleeps um, from the aromatherapy. This is the black chamomile, and this one smells so good. I mean, it's, it is really, oh my gosh. This one's really good. I love the packaging also. It's black and sleek and classic, and this one's really good. And this one's just perfect for like your, you know, whenever you do your linens and stuff like that. I just like to spray it when I have my, you know, my new linens out. And I just love it. It smells good, and it makes everything feel fresh, I think. And, yeah, so... Of all in all, I think the best the best um, finds I, I, I actually am happy about is the strawberry pound cake, the lemon mint leaf, and the vanilla bean. I mean, to be honest, I think all of them because I'm so happy with the pistachio ice cream. I'm so happy with that one. The flamingo beach also. Just everything. It's it's really good. I'm really happy. And there's also some other stuff in here that but I actually wasn't able to show it because it's packaged up as a gift. So I did buy other stuff, you know, like two for 18, the candles, the one wicks. And got some soaps also um, for um, a gift. But anyways, um, you know, I don't want to show it here because just in case they, I don't think they're going to watch it or anything. But it's already packed up, and I don't want to go through all that. But anyways, I think that's going to be it. I think it's going to be it for today. And um, I really want to let you know that I really appreciate your views, and I thank you so much for watching. And you have a great day. Bye bye.